Hello there, it is I, Hamster of Wrath, back with some more Ghost of Tsushima, which we are recording uh, exclusively for YouTube at the moment, because I'm having a bit of a break from live streaming. So, let's get back into it. Except it's not capturing, so that's good. Oh no, there it is. <laughs> I'm like, of course the screen is black, you idiot, because it's, it's black <laughs> in the transition. Strong start. Okay, what have you got to do? You have many things to do. Um, hmm. We go looking for this bow or this bow. Oh, we get explosive arrows out of that. Okay, and a long bow. Totally, totally should do that. I think that's a good idea. Okay, also hoping that I am. Oh, it's showing me where to find it. Okay, paying attention. So unfortunately, uh, last time around when I recorded this, I uh, I had the bitrate uh, set for Twitch, which uh, made the YouTube video look a little scuffed. So I'm hoping that uh, setting it a little bit higher has fixed that problem, because uh, I was like, why does it still look fuzzy? I'm recording from a source. And then it was like, oh, I've I've left it at Twitch bit rates, which was not schmod, but that's OK. Is it getting dark or getting light? I can't tell. Also, there's a thing that seems to be very on fire over there. Oh, and a beastie. Is it a pig? Is it a bear? Is it a werewolf? Oh, it's a pig. Uh, let's not use explosive arrows or fire arrows. Oh, nice little 360 spin on the... Uh... <laughs> I got a little a nice little 360 no-scope in the saddle there. That's quite impressive. I love how earlier on the pigs were like, we, we will eat you. And and now I've got a bow. They seem to be quite reluctant. Um, also, hitting a moving target from a horse is going to be a problem. Oh, that's how you, you do that without actually uh, letting it loose. Okay. Uh, I'm going to leave you guys be. Though I do need the predator hides. But yeah, previously, they're kind of like... It's almost like they've noticed I've leveled up. So they're like, we're not going to attack you. We are but, but humble piggies. Um, when they actually had a chance of killing me. And now, of course, not so much. You watch, I'll come around the corner and there'll be like a sea of angry pigs. And I will get eaten. Now, the one thing I have completely forgotten to do, actually, is uh, use my hay fever stuff this morning. So, uh, <laughs> if I start sniffing, I may have to go and uh, remedy that. And that's the glory of editing, of course. That, uh... If I do have to do that, I can just stop the uh, video and, uh, well, not stop the video. Whoa, that's a big drop. Um, edit the video later. See? The, the glories of recorded footage. Oh, what's this? Lord Sakai, I studied poetry with your uncle. Oh, does he want me to do more uh, terrible haikus? The Mongols have taken Lord Shimura captive. Mm. He will endure. He is strong and resilient, skilled in the art of combat and poetry. Do you practice haiku, my lord? There is no time during war. War is the reason to make time. Haiku allows one to concentrate, eliminate chaos, to find peace. Precisely. My favorite place to write lies atop the cliff. It is one of many such places. If you look, you will find inspiration all across Tsushima. I hope I can find quiet places like this one, untouched by war. Look for the birds. They will show you the way. So, hilariously, um, I guess this is like the haiku tutorial, despite the fact we've actually done like several haikus, but never mind. <laughs> this is fine. Um... Oh, I can actually do one here. Okay. Or somewhere. Wait, it says it was there. Wait, wait, what? He or she haiku, not complete. Well, he won't speak to me anymore. Do I sit next to him? No. Not sure. Oh, well. We'll come back. I mean, I've been doing haikus forever. 
I mean, not forever, but I mean, it has happened a couple of times. I've come across like, oh, you must do this. And I'm like, oh, I've already done that. And I'm like, sorry. Now, you see, that's a patrol. Ordinarily, in the early game, I would have said to avoid that. But now I've got some really kick-ass abilities. I'm actually going to go straight at them. Because I'm a maniac. Maniac on the dance floor. Stand and fight! We also have the double kill with the, uh... With the, the strike here. Wait for it. Boy. Whoa! Tricky boy. Tricky boy. Okay, that's two for two. We are solid. Uh, you an archer? Oh. Yeah, I thought you napping. Right. Anti-shield stance. Ahoy. Nail it. Anti-sword charge. Short charge? Short charge. The anti-short charge. See, if I had been that reckless earlier, I would have got my ass handed to me. Getting the hang of that! Come on. See, if that had been a, if that had been a patrol earlier, I would have got my ass handed to me, but apparently not. Not anymore. Also, learning to switch between the stances is really quite useful, too. Is there one guy left? I think there's one guy left. Hello, sir. Oh, that's a separate patrol. Challenge me. That's an entirely separate patrol. We've already got sidetracked. This is glorious. Oh, he was a fast one. Okay. I do love how they changed the timing on that, so it's not always the same. You missed. My god, those stances make all the difference. They really do. Quick slash! Am I being, am I being ha hassled by his bird? Right. Well, can't see. Missed entirely. Sorry, enemy bird. Oh, hello. You'll be free soon. I always remember you. Be careful up there. Please. A token of my gratitude. <laughs> Sorry if you hear a strange thump and a rumble every so often. Uh, it's my it's my keyboard shelf. I really need to tighten it up. Also, it's uh, absolutely uh, bonkers um, busy outside, but I think my filters are avoiding all of that, so that's good. Right, well, that was entirely incidental to where we were going. Search Yoshi for the island. Well, here's the thing. I'm in the middle of a forest, which makes you think that uh, finding an island here is quite unlikely. So I think finding a body of water would be... A good start. I wouldn't mind it if these guys would like very rarely drop like one iron or something. That would be cool, but they don't seem to do that. Right, if I was an island, where would I be? Well, I'd be in the middle of a body of water because it's, it's an island. That's generally how islands work. Isonade Coast. Okay. Probably a good place to find an island. And probably a good place to find some dead people. Oh dear. Alright, am I still within the search area? Well within the search area. Okay, so it's over there, I'm guessing. Um, now what did, what did he say it looks like? It's covered in blue flowers. Now, it might be that island, if that island is facing away from me. I mean, facing away from me, you get the idea. I think that might be a solid bet. Actually, this looks like a shrine. Hmm. I should have escaped shrine. Let's see if I can get down there without breaking my neck. Or any other part of my anatomy. Um. I mean, that looks. Well, actually, that looks quite a. That looks quite a drop. 
Hmm. I don't see the point of going all the way down and come all the way back again. I might be able to survive it. Let's find out. Probably not. Okay. Um. That's so funny. I'm so used to streaming. I keep thinking, oh, have I done all these other things? I'm like, y y you're not streaming. You're, uh, you're recording. Oh, well. This has gone badly for all involved. Uh, I think this is one of the other clans. I don't know what it is. But you'll just indulge me. Oh, no, let's not do that for a second. Let me just make sure everything is recording well. See what size the... Uh, size the uh, file is because i'm using a slightly different bit right it's okay actually it's fairly constant okay trying to make sure i don't like uh make a file too huge well it'll be pretty huge because it should come out in 1080p uh proper 1080p i'm probably going to edit this bit out to be honest i'll have to find a way of marking it out but there we go what, what do usually the pros do they usually clap don't they yeah um, okay, there's blue flowers. Okay. Probably could have kept the horse, to be honest. Is that another patrol? Um, could be. Or is it just a dude with a wagon? Oh, no. I need to practice my archery a little bit, to be honest. Let's make sure I'm actually targeting a bad guy. Yep. Okay, let's aim for the noggin. Nice. Not dead, though. Oh, got him square in the head. Oof. Oh. Perfect parry. That always worries me when they go for the unblockable and um, you kill them. You can still see the red light on the weapon and you're like, oh my god, oh, oh no, it's fine. You would... That was it. Wood. Bamboo. Iron. That'd be nice. Supplies. No? That's it. And a free horse. Not that I want a free horse. Uh, possibly two free horses, actually. Where's my horse gone? My horse is miles away. More blue flowers. Aha! Follow the blue flowers. There we go. It's like the yellow brick road, only it's blue and it's made of flowers. It's very different. Well, the flu blue flowers appear to have pe Oh no, okay, they're over there. So, by definition, in order to be an island, it needs to be in the sea. Or in a river. Does it have to be in the sea? I'm not sure. A large body of water. Well, that looks like is that a campfire. It's a campfire up there. Um, okay, this is looking promising. Oh, yeah, found it. But this almost perfectly matches the picture. Look at that. Oh, that's really cool, actually. <laughs> not not quite not quite the right angle, but uh, that's really nifty. Sometimes with, like, I think it's like it's happened in, like, Assassin's Creed a couple of times. They're like, here is this map. You must match the pictures. And I'm like... This, that picture's not great, where in this one, it's like literally exactly what it looks like, and it's like, ah, cool. Uh, okay, horse doesn't swim very well, so let's dismount the horse. Go for a swim. Yeah, I know you can do the whole stealth swim thing, I've got to remember that. That's why I did bow sticking out on top of it. I look like a really shit version of Jaws. Okay, let's get the island. Now, bearing in mind this bow is supposedly cursed, I'm not sure do I really actually want it. What do we got here? Examine. A mountain surrounded by blue flowers. Ah. Which is in this bow could be there. So this is a this is a even further thing. Oh, we got we got to chase this around something chronic. Okay. I wonder how much health I've got if I'm wearing my traveler's armor. Because the Traveler's Armor tends to show you some stuff. Um, bearing in mind, I can actually upgrade that. Let's, well, actually, I say put more charms in it. 
Um, maybe we should go for the like stealth aspect on this one. Increase the arrow damage. He says going for arrow damage. Charm of Shadows. Um, solve. Yeah, let's go with the arrow damage. So we're kind of less. How much? How much more health is that? Not a great drop in health, to be honest. I'll probably take more damage. But I figure since we're exploring. Oh, fuck me, rigid. Continue your search, and Tsushima will fall. Enough. Speak plainly. This is your last chance. Leave the boat alone. This is this angry monk dude who's not very happy with the situation. Right. Uh, oh, we gotta go right back where we came from. That's not irritating in the slightest. Okay, let's fast travel to there. Also, the trapper has some upgrades for us, so should, we could could check in on him actually. Um, where is the camp? Supposedly, I'm looking at it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Literally around the corner. Right. What you got, trapper? Range capacity upgrades. Ooh, flaming arrows. Okay, uh, yeah, we're gonna upgrade the flaming arrows, that's for sure. Only the best for you. Right, can we do that again? 20. Okay, now we'll keep that. Wind chimes? Yep, it's up the wind chimes. I do occasionally use those. Just for you. Okay, well, that works oh. for me. I'll make an offering for your good fortune. Don't think there's anything else. May I assist you, my lord. Ooh, armor dies. Oh, okay, that's what the flowers are used for. I forget about this. Traveler's attire. Oh yeah, traveler's attire. Fiery searcher. Ooh. Red and uh, red and blue? Red and green? Not sure. Let's go for that. Use it to defeat the invaders. Well, not really. I will use it to look slightly different. Because apparently that's what I do. Right. Uh... Ah, here we go. Now I am... Well, it's kind of greenish, I think. Can't tell. Greeny bluey. Now I look like a samurai hobo. Oh, okay. I can't stand that um, fuzzy scabbard anymore, honestly. I bought that as a bit of a meme, but oh, I don't think I can handle it. Let's go with that. I might actually vaguely color coordinate. Or not. Only Falcon. Spring bamboo. Yeah, okay, that might actually tally in. Hey, color coordination. Right, okay. For the mountain. Right, well, if I was a mountain. I'd probably be very tall, because that's what mountains are like. <laughs> oh, boy. Oops, broke the campfire. Sorry. Okay. Elu. What have we got here? Aside from broken ankles, just remembered the button to do the soft pull just as I threw myself down there. Ah, more blue flowers. Okay, I see how this is. Alright, let's summon my horse. Blue flowers. This is the right way. Okay. Well, the blue flowers are going up the mountain, so I assume that is the way to go. Yep, this looks promising. Oh, it's red. The bow must be there. So we're inevitably going to have to fight the monk when we do this, because <laughs> bearing in mind this is supposedly cursed. Which is in his longbow. Yep, we're now cursed. Where am I? 
bow is cursed. You will see nothing but death to the end of your days. Oh, I got Jewel the guy. Oh, wow, okay. I'm not wearing the right outfit for this. This could be interesting. Right, so I probably want to be in swordsman stance. I'm covered in blood for some reason. Right, swordsman stance. Whoa! So some of this stuff I can block and some of it I can't. Oh, like that, for example. I really should have been wearing my armor for this. Do you not fear the demons curse? First I'll drive the Mongols from a hole. After that I'll worry about curses. All perfect parry. Okay, if I didn't have the sword block, that might well, actually hit the sword block, that's quite funny actually. Whoa! Oh, that's unblockable. As is that. Really should have worn my armor. Oh wait, I can use Heavenly Strike. Come on, Heavenly Strike. There we go. It's that little backswing he does. Oh, I'm probably screwed. Yep, I'm screwed. Okay, I need to swap my armor. <laughs> if it will give me a chance, which I don't think it will. Whoa, okay. So I just made this more difficult for myself. On account, I don't have the armor. That's quite funny. I have just unlocked hard mode for this fight. First, I'll drive the Mongols from our home. After that, I'll worry about cursing. It's those fucking bats in the background. It's actually completely throwing me off. My eyeballs keep looking at the bats, which I'm sure is probably the reason they're there. Alright, why did my block didn't work there? I don't know. Yeah, I, I'm gonna have to go to a previous save here, because I took my armor off, and he's kicking my ass because I took my armor off. No, 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 no. Right, okay. Um, except the last checkpoint is going to be this checkpoint, isn't it? Yes. Oh, well. Hard mode it is. First, I'll drive the Mongols from our home. After that, I'll worry about the curses. Oh, I actually interrupted him there. That was good work. Oh, that's unblockable. Haha! <laughs> oh, shit. As is that. Yeah, he tries to suck you in with that one. I need to do my side swipe, actually. There you go, that didn't work. Oh, he's immune to that, great. Shit. You see? The demons will harm you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Unblockable. Oh, I fucking stacked that one. I nearly had him. I nearly had him. It's so annoying I can't go back and sort my armor out. Oh, I can. Can I? Can I do this mid-fight? I shouldn't be able to do this mid-fight. This feels like cheating. 
Okay, I'll take it. Ooh, perfect parry, nice. Come on. First, I'll drive the Mongols from our home. After that, I'll worry about the I'm so clumsy. Oh, that's unblockable. Yeah. Oh, it's unblockable. Gotta remember that. Yeah, probably. I apparently can't. I've lost the ability to block. This is amazing. Nearly. Nailed it. First time. <laughs> Covered in demon crows. Foreshadowing. The curse of Uchitsune. I'm not entirely sure I actually cut my cause there at all. I'll be brutally honest with you. Right, now I have a longbow. High damage and zoom, but a long draw time. And you can't crouch while aiming. Okay. Explosive arrow. Nice! So let's have a look at that. Oh, it has different, ar uh, different um, arrows? Really? It, it uses entirely different arrows. I feel that's a little bit cheesy. I mean, I suppose it kind of makes sense, but... I mean... An arrow is an arrow, mostly. No, we have to have heavy arrows. Okay. I still don't know why this guy says... It says, Hiyoshi Haiku not complete. Let's go, let's go back there. That's bugging me. I hate leaving stuff half-finished. He says, having a history of leaving stuff half-finished. Yeah, note to self, don't do boss fights when you're in your pyjamas. It's never a good idea. It does explain why I was getting my ass handed to me in a lot of other fights, because, um... <laughs> because I was fighting them in my pyjamas. Which is, you know, not not smart. Right, horse. Here. Behold. You're a good horse, Kage. Let's go. Wait, which way is the wind blowing? Straight up. Okay. I love how I don't actually hit these bamboo uh, trees, because that would be really awkward. Oh, that's a sheer drop. Don't want to take the horse down there. Oh, hello. Are you... Are you good guys? You're not attacking me. Hello. My lord, welcome. As you can see, Hiyoshi is a special place. How did the tree grow so quickly? <laughs> the forest protects those who can't protect themselves. Oh. Wow. The... The... Okay. The tree grew through the guy. Okay, that's... Uh, that's impressive. Considering there is no blood on the actual... That's... Yeah, well... Oh. Oh, okay. Let's let's not question it. Right, now there's a way down over there. Okay. Yeah. 
question ye not the weird shit that doth happen. I mean, I just fought a demon, so I suppose, you know. I fought a demon while surrounded by crows. Was it crows or bats? I think I, I called them bats, but I'm pretty sure they're actually crows. Oh, this looks like a hot spring. Is that a hot spring I have not discovered? I think it might be, you know. Oh, no, it isn't. It's just a river. Wait, what did that say? Something, something before you... I didn't read it. Went past too fast. Maybe it is a hot spring. Ah, oh, this is where you said look for the birds. That's where you can write a haiku. Okay. It was, in fact, not the same place where the guy was sitting. Or maybe it was. Maybe he disappeared. Right, okay, let's make, an, let's make another terrible one. Reflect on serenity. Okay, this should be a good one. Feel the earth below. Whispers through the trees. Clear skies and clear mind. I mean, clear skies and clear mind sounds good. Clear skies, clear mind. A cool bed beneath the stars. That sounds like a good fit. Swaying freely in the wind. What's swaying re freely in the wind? Let's do, let's do it in the wind, because we're going to, like, wind and sky. And then we're left with growing ever strong, sturdy defense. Let's say growing ever strong. Clear skies and clear mind. Swaying freely in the wind. Growing ever strong. The old man was right. My spirit feels at peace. Strong. I should compose more poems. Yeah, so that was that was like that was the haiku tutorial, and we've done like about four of them already. What does the headband of serenity look like? Pretty nice actually. Pretty sweet. Okay. Um where should we go? There was another side quest down here. No empty baskets. No, it was way down south. Okay, there we go. Seven of the people. I mean, this guy was in the in the bloody intro, I think. But there's there's plenty of other things besides. What's this? The Adachi Estate. Utsune's tomb. Um. And a mother's peace. Okay. Let's go. Value of sake. We have to rescue the sake. I think that's a good thing. Let's rescue the sake. Uh, let's do a cheeky little fast travel. Not the sake. Um. We're thinking about. Right, where's the armor? Uh, no, that's the swordsmith. The armor's around the corner. Oh yes, hang on, no, we can get upgrades to the bow. Our new shiny bow. We need to do that probably. Right, let's do a longbow. So just basic upgrade to the longbow sounds good. A bow without equal. Um, a half bow. No, that's gonna cost me everything I've got. I'll see you again. When will I see you again? Okay, anyway. Um if I was an armorer, where would I be? I think she's down on the left here. Or up on the left here. Here we go. Yoink. Yeah, I know, I just fought a guy in my pajamas, didn't go well. 
Oh, she can only upgrade... You need more to make these improvements. Oh, okay, because I spent the resources, I can't upgrade that now. Okay, what's the next upgrade for the, uh, the samurai armor? Oh, lots. Okay. Let's not worry about that for now. Wait, what was the... Where was the upgrade for the ammo? Have I still only got... Yeah, that's upgrades to... I want ranged upgrades. Like, more arrows. Boria. Is that the trapper? I think it's the trapper that does that. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, it's the trapper that does the, uh, the ammo upgrades. Right, bollocks. Okay, in which case, I'm going to go over there and do that. Because <laughs> four longbow arrows is not enough. Would you like to see what I have? Not I'm right now. To assist you. Right, range capacity. Heavy arrow. There we go. Predator hide 10. Okay. Uh, explosive arrow. Predator hide 10. Okay. So we need to be hunting more piggies. I hope it helps. More piggies, more bears. Until we next meet. Pitch to enter room. More piggies, more bears. Right. Let's get back on the... Back on the plan there. Okay. Wind says go this way. Yes, that way. I know from Assassin's Creed Odyssey is never summon your horse in the middle of the village. It never goes well. It's behind me. Oh, yes. Whoa! That was a nifty move. Didn't know I could do that. All right, let's make sure I'm actually heading in the right direction. Yes, I am. Let's go. Okay. So there is a mountain range between me and my uh, objective, so... Uh, is that a shrine? We must have done that one. Yeah. That's an old one. I think. Let's double check. Pretty sure I did. Hello? Uh, yes, Golden Solar Shrine. Yep, I already did that one. Let's sum it as in peak or highest place as opposed to summat, which is uh, very bad English. <laughs> Samurai in summit. Oh no. Oh, I thought that was a bit far for pause. Apparently it wasn't. Everything is very on fire. I mean, I suppose we are on at war. That makes sense that plenty of places are on fire. These are not predators, ergo I'm not interested in shooting them. I mean, if you're an idiot enough to run in front of my horse, that's not my problem. Here. So yeah, now I'm completely off wearing the Traveler's uh, armor because um, I'm worried I'll get in a big fight. Is that a bear? I hear a bear. Oh, a bear is absolutely kicking the ass of somebody. Okay, let's try this new bow out. Yeah, I see ya. Did I get him? Oh! That guy... I'm... I'm gonna be honest with you. I was slightly confused about the turn of events there. There, there was a guy, and the, then there was a bear, and then he went flying backwards, and the bear fell down, and I, I, I'm I, slightly perplexed. <laughs> okay, let's not question good fortune. So it turns out the bow's pretty good. That is precisely why I upgraded it, because like, now I'm down to five arrows. I guess that's like more of an assassin weapon, whereas the half bow is more like a stand-up fight weapon. Which makes sense. Oh, hello. Who's seen me? Are there dudes? Ah, there are many dudes. They are on the roof. I wonder if I can get up there without anyone seeing. 
Or alternatively, get this guy down here. Oh, yeah, okay. You saw nothing, Jon Snow. Right, two guys on the roof, two guys on the ground. I wonder if I can... Okay, I'm going to switch to um, the anti-spear stance, because I want to use this new kick I've got. Can I get up there? I must be able to get up there. Oh, either that or we take out the guys on the ground. Hmm... Oh, I can squeeze through here. Okay. That that availed me nothing. Oh. Right, let's try this new thing. You! Oh, ouch. Right. You! No, never mind. You! You! Oh, I didn't do the Kung Fu kick. Oh, he... Wow, he ate that. <laughs> Holy shit. That was pretty cool. Let's just try the Kung Fu kick. Come on. Nice! Not entirely useless against other people. Okay, I, li I like that. I like that technique. That's a nice technique. Okay, got some technique points to spend. Speaking of techniques, um, got his stances. Increase stagger damage against spearmen. I mean, that sounds pretty good. Stagger damage against swordsmen. I think maybe we should just upgrade his stances. Now we're actually learning how those work. That's uh, going pretty well. Right, was there any loot? This is entirely incidental to the main quest. Ah, now three arrows. Is that three regular arrows? I'm assuming it's regular arrows. Kind of annoying if you don't pick up heavy arrows in the wild. That'd be kind of annoying. Uh, you would. <laughs> you would. Uh, supplies. Uh, I think that's it. Oh, what's that? Is that a banner? Ah, Sashimono banner. <laughs> New saddle available. Return to the monk. Oh, okay. Upgrade to go go. This is kind of like a lot of the things I liked about uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, that you could flick between um, stealth and straight-up combat, however you still fit. Though the stealth in Odyssey was notional, shall we say. Oh, oh, Bird is telling me something. What are you, what, what are you telling me? Are you leading him into danger? Probably. Speak with the woman. Well, I, I already knew that's where we were going. But is that what you're telling me? No, it's not, is it? Where have you gone? This is what happens if you have a bird as your guide. It's not, um... It's not 100% useful. Where did it go? Oh, it's on the roof. Okay, so it's saying there is probably... Well, it's either supplies are in the building or supplies are on the roof. One of the two. Let's check the building. Hello, I'm here to casually steal your stuff. Or is it hidden? Ah! Is it under here? No. <laughs> They're probably looking at me and it's like, what is this maniac doing? Looking for loot. And not finding it. Right, maybe the bird did mean on the roof. No, I, I can't get on there? Okay. Was the bird lying? Oh no, the bird's still going. Oh, hello bird. 
What? What? Oh, well, I was coming here anyway, but thanks. Oh, arrows. Oh, heavy arrow. Okay, cool. Hello, madam. Is everything all right? Uh, would you care to join me for a cup of tea? Tea? <laughs> this is the famed Key Sake Brewery of Ozamo. Please, this way. You insult me with an offer of tea? Wind chimes. Oh, I've already got them full. Apologies, my lord. I couldn't speak freely out there. The Mongols might have overheard. <laughs> what Mongols? I think I've killed most of them. The Mongols have been here? They've been drinking us dry. I can't fault their taste. Kisake is the pride of Tsushima. Especially compared to that horse piss they drink. I think it's mare's milk. <laughs> Is there a difference? When are they coming back? Soon. Take your workers and hide. I'll deal with the Mongols. Find an ambush spot. Okay. Need to find a good spot for an ambush. Everyone, gather round. We need to get behind the brewery and stay out of sight. Friend here is going to renegotiate our relationship with the Mongols. Renegotiate. Yep, that's me. I'm the renegotiating guy. Now we're going to be sneaky. We're going to be. That's easy for him to say. Right, so we could do a standoff. All right, who? Let's see who looks the biggest. He does. Oh, that's an archer. Wow. Okay. Oh, he's not dead. Good. Good. Good work. I mean, he is now. Oh, two perfect parries in a row. Come on. That's the wrong stance. That's the right stance. Right tool for the job. Everybody said damn the small. Where? Oh, okay, spear stance. Spear stance. Nice. Alright, kick out. Guy shot me in the ass. I really should learn to get out of the way of those. <laughs> See, you can launch those guys with that. That's pretty good. Ow. Why am I not blocking? Okay, double shields. Oh yeah, kunai. Not about the kunai. Oh god, that whistled past my ear. That's impressive. Okay, he's spicy. Any more? Oh, he's a big boy. Okay. Good night. Oh, that guy, that he just shot his own guy. That's a bit of a shame. Long. Oh. We won. I think we won. Pretty comprehensively. I just bowed. <laughs> I was, well done, my lord. I was super sarcastic. 
Thank you for letting me kick your ass. Yo, this is such a difference from the um, first couple of fights I had in this game where I got my ass absolutely handed to me. I'm still not great with the um, unblockable attacks, but it's it's much better than it was. Uh, I just always think, you know, you, you, see, you see one guy mow down like five of your friends and be kind of like, do you know what, let's, let's maybe either negotiate or run... Or, you know, reevaluate our life choices, but no. The Mongols will be back when their men don't return. Can you stay? You could drink as much sake as you like. It would be on the house. I'm afraid you'll need to relocate. Try the Golden Temple in Ariake. Many have found refuge there. Thank you, my lord. Excellent. Everyone will now get shit faced at the Golden Temple. I like this new bow. I'm really liking this new bow. <laughs> a charm of resolve. I think I've already got one of those. Is there a way of selling your excess charms, I wonder? Although they do stack, so maybe there's a good reason not to. Right. Anything else I can pilfer from this place, since they're about to leave it anyway. I keep forgetting about like crawling in the little under spaces. I should I should learn that one. It'd be quite funny to just come out and slash someone's ankles off. Well, it sounds like the start of a really like quirky horror story. The samurai who lived under the house. <laughs> I doubt anyone would want to read it, but all right. Any supplies? I don't feel bad about this one because they are literally buggering off. Oh. That's that's just into the crawl space again. Um I think I have mostly pillaged their wealth. Which is fair, I mean I beat the brakes off the bad guys. Oh oh no, that's just the floor glowing. I thought oh there's loot. It's like no, just the floor glowing. Right! 100% success. Right, okay. Um, what else we got? Empty baskets. Bandits are stealing food. Oh, there's another um, uh, Mongol place there. Let's go there. There's a lot to do in this game, which I approve of. Question mark? What is the question mark? Oh, it's literally right next to me. It is... Is it a bamboo thing? It's... Oh, hot spring! Hey! Right, prepare for samurai butt. Samurai butt! Oh, what do I reflect on? Creature comforts or Sensei Ishikawa? Let's do Sensei Ishikawa. Sensei Ishikawa should visit this place. I wonder if he's ever relaxed in his life. He's Probably not. tighter than his bowstring. It's getting a bit tricky. I should use my magic flute and change the weather. <laughs> That's such a neat little feature. Actually, I wonder... I can't remember. I legitimately can't remember how you... Um, upgrade his, uh, like he has, um, different songs he can sing? Uh, tunes he can play? Bugger if I can remember how you actually get the upgrades for that. 
or where I would find them. The accessories? Ah, oh, here we go. Song that can change the weather. Uh, oh, singing crickets. That's it. Oh, that's it. Yeah, it's the little box of crickets we have to find. Okay, so we can bring on a storm, fog. Oh, okay. I wonder if, like, summoning fog makes you more stealthy, because that'd be really quite handy. Okay, let's go have a word with these, uh, this Mongol settlement. See how much stealth we can do before the inevitable giant Barney breaks down. Is it a settlement? Is it big or is it small? I think it might be small. Also, it looks like an amazing vantage point up there, which I probably should take advantage of. Take advantage of the vantage point, yes. How many bows have I got? How many bows have I got? How many arrows have I got? Okay, we're back up to four. Okay. I thought I upgraded that. Did we just not pick any up? Probably didn't pick any up. Right. Kill staggered enemies. Find and observe the Mongol leader. Okay. If I was a Mongol leader, where would I be? He's usually the biggest looking dude in the entire camp. That's usually a fair indication. Ah, there he is. It's always the guy having like a a, a moment. Am I not close enough? Oh, there we go. Observe leader. Flailing like a madman. And as we learned last time, if we observe and then kill people, uh, we get double points. What were the other objectives? Kill staggered enemies? This reach encounter area. That means. Oh no, that says defeat the Mongols. Kill staggered enemies. Oh, is that because I observed the leader? Oh, okay. I mean, you could just, like, get down there and shank him. Maybe we'll get rid of the archers first, actually. Yeah, that might not be a bad idea. Alright, let's see how good I can get with this bow. Oh, he bloody went ran down the thing. Well, that's torn that slightly, hasn't it? I was hoping I could readdress and get the other guy, but... Oh, oh, oh. Hello, sir. You saw nothing. Oh, never mind. Someone someone set the alarm off. <laughs> I am the best at stealth. Nope. Must have been the wind. Everyone relax. I wonder what happens if I shoot the second guy. Ooh. Oh, I thought he was going to fall off, but he didn't. Okay, that worked far too well. <laughs> Right, we can take the leader out because he's kind of on his own with a bit of luck. Also, suddenly it's night, so that works. Oh, 
Oh, need to learn to block. Block, block, blocking is good. Down. Oh no. You missed. Wow. Uh, heal? Heal, thank you. Wow, my healing wasn't working. I don't know why. That was weird. I have cocked this up amazingly. Alright, double points. Okay, let's go back into sword stance. That's one staggered enemy. Shield stance. Missed. He staggered. Two staggered enemies. Staggered enemies. Nice. Ow. Wow, I ate that one. Wow, how did... Okay, that looks like he shot through the bloody thing. I couldn't figure out how he hit me the second time. If I slowly climb up here... Okay, I'm going to try to kick. That actually killed him. That's great. That was actually a, something I wanted to test out. I was kind of like, can you kill people if you kick them first and then they fall down? The answer is yes. Right, these guys are facing outwards, so if I come up behind them... Oh. I was trying to be a little bit more sneaky than that. I do like the fact you can't just sneak around the whole time. They do it. They are actually very good at spotting you. Mostly. Right, are they resetting? And I love how they watch each other's back like that. That's quite funny. One guy's walking forwards, the other guy's walking backwards. What's that? Oh, that just tells me I can assassinate them. Supplies! Oh, I could have got that guy too. Bonus objective completed, increased legend. Ah, nice. Did we win? I think we won. Oh, I'm bowing. I meant to clean my sword. I've now put away. Did I put my sword away dirty? Oh, that's poor form. Right, time for lootings. That went pretty well. Steel supplies. Um, I want some iron. Iron is good. Yeah, there we go. I just love how they leave iron lying on the floor. Just meaningless to us. We just leave it on the floor. I kind of wish um, the like Batman vision would show you the supplies as well, but. Ooh, heavy arrow. Nice. Oh, it does. Sort of. Alright, it makes them stick out a little better. Mongol artifact. That looks like a saddle of some description. Maximum versatility in combat. Okay. A reward available. New saddle. Return to the monk. Okay. 
All the wind chimes. Some ammo. I'm liking that, uh, that this new bow. <laughs> it's just like, bunk! Uh, any more? Pretty more. No, ammo's full. Did I have a look in here? Might have done. Oh, smoke bomb full. Wait, there was, is there more than one tent? Maybe there was only one tent. Lurking with intent. I made that joke already. More floor iron. My favourite kind. We must be getting close to a sword upgrade at some point. Though, in fairness, the amount of damage we're putting out is kind of nuts at the moment, so I shouldn't worry too much, I don't think. I seriously have one tent with the entire That must have been crowded. Yeah, they do. They only have one tent. <laughs> They must have been on very good terms. Ooh, leather. Uh, iron. Lovely. Uh, ooh, what's that? Oh, we could have, could have stealthed through the wall. Oh, well. Right. Where was I actually going? Right, Stone Arch Crossing complete. Oh, there's a couple of question marks as well. Uh, I think I was going towards empty baskets, but now I've got random things to look at. Actually, at some point I should try mowing someone down with the horse. I think that's a thing I can do. Ah, Legend Storyteller. No use to me at all, because that is the... Pretty sure that's the co-op, isn't it? Or is that the co-op? Uh, into Legends mode, yeah. No, don't do that. No, you don't have to tell me the tale. I'm not interested. It is fine. Right, that's across the river. Is there a bridge? Not seeing a bridge. Oh! I see land, though. Wait, it's raining. Let's change the weather. I'm sure there was another game where you, you did a song. Oh, no, I'm thinking of Skyrim. There was a shout that could clear the weather because um, one of the dragon's abilities was to make a weather shit, which is a bit of a rubbish ability, really, when you get down to it, but... was it? To my left. Oh, I have magical bird. What are you telling me, magical bird? Okay. Oh, you've just done a loop, my dude. That's not helpful. Ah, oh, the giant campfire, perhaps? Oh, it's another hot spring. Oh, covered in mongols. Let's assess the situation before we throw ourselves at it. Okay. Four? I think that's four. Wait, we haven't tried the explosive arrows yet. <laughs> strike their power. Uh, uh, strike the target with a powerful explosive impact. Okay. Let's see what happens. Oh, wow. That pissed in his chips. God damn. Invisible man! Alright, let's abandon subtlety. I want, I want to kick someone, hold on. And Kung Fu kick! That's not Kung Fu, Karate kick, whatever. That's 
that's what you get for squatting on the bath, so to speak. Then I, I killed a bunch of dudes. Then I got naked. <laughs> Which I suppose is better than doing it the other way around, I suppose. <laughs> Next spring, my code. We're going to reflect on the code. People look to Samurai for guidance. To keep them safe. And act with honor. On and off the battlefield. I can't forget that. I mean, except, you know, I do stab people in the back for expediency's sake these days. Excellent. Um, so let's head towards the empty baskets. Uh, where's my horse gone? There he is. I'm assuming there's going to be a lot of things to discover between it, but we'll see. Say like when I think something's nearby and suddenly it's like, oh, that's 400 meters away. It's like, this map is huge. And this is only one part of it, I think. Alright, bamboo I've got. I thought I saw something. I see something? Nope, guess not. I actually read the quest, actually. I was like, what are we doing? Bandits are stealing food. And people were... Okay, cool. We can do that. I really hope you can't hear all the stuff from outside. Because, my god, it's loud. Speak to the distressed woman in Sutu. I'm seeing a lot of open ground here. This could be interesting if it came down to a fight, but okay. Hi. Hello, madam. What happened? Bandits, my lord. They took my food. <laughs> Every last scrap. Do you see where they went? Northeast, into the woods. If I find them, they'll regret stealing from you. Please don't harm them. They're just as desperate as I am. Um... No promises. Not really sure how that's going to work. I'm not blessed with a plethora of non-lethal options, I will say that. Do I talk to them nicely? Do I have to sneak the food out? Um, hmm... It's gone very foggy again. Or misty. I don't know. I think it's coming off the ground. It's mist, technically, isn't it? I'm not sure. Search for the bandits. Okay. I was a bandit. Oh, there's a bandit. And she says, don't harm them. How am I going to do that? Feel they will harm me. I try and steal the food. Is there a is there another path? Food's almost gone. I know. That rice is the last of it. Shinzo spotted an old woman across the way. He thinks she has food. We should pay her a visit. <laughs> Things aren't bad enough to steal from old women. We'll see how you feel when the rice is gone. Okay, I'm going to see if I can steal from them. She's, she said don't kill them. Search for the stolen food. What's the chance it's in that bundle there? 
if we get bonus points if we don't kill them. Alright, that's the wrong button. What I want to do is throw a chime over there. over there. Let's see. Okay, good, 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 good. Alright, if I was food, where would I be? Right. I found the food. The food they store. Wow, we actually did that without killing anyone. Oh, oh, oh dear. Oh, I did too. Look at that. I was nice. I actually used stealth. It was super effective. Now, of course, what's going to stop them coming back and taking it a second time? I don't know. I wonder if I get bonus points for that. I really should get bonus points for that. I went out of my way not to murder them. Is this a trap? I wonder if this is a trap. My lord, you're back. I have your food. Rice. I don't remember the last time I had rice. You said they stole it from you. Please, for forgive me. You lied to me. Bandits don't deserve food at a time <laughs> like this, my lord. Besides, I ask you not to hurt them. Luckily, I didn't have to. Oh, thank you. You shouldn't have lied. I still would have helped you. I won't do it again. I promise. So, I guess if we'd gone in there and just butchered everyone, they would have been a bit upset about it. But there we go. Charm of Resistance. I think I've already got a couple of those. Oh, no, I haven't. Reduces all damage by a minor amount. Ooh. How can I fit that in? And we're not really having a problem with Resolve at the moment. Let's put it in... Uh, yeah, let's put it in there. Bit of damage reduction. Can't go wrong with that. Well, except she had a huge amount of supplies. She's like, I'm starving, but there's still, like, stuff just scattered around here. I, I had a funny feeling. It was very odd. She she was like, don't don't hurt them. And it was like, mm, something, something's afoot here. I mean, look, she's got supplies all over the place, but she's like, I'm starving. And I'm like, well, sure. Um, okay. It is gone about 20 minutes past the hour, so I think I'm going to call things uh, to a halt there. Um, uh, you can find all my assorted links and things in the description for the video, so have a look at that uh, if you've made it this far. Um, and I shall catch you next time. Bye-bye.